All right, guys, so we're gonna review when she expects princess treatment, but you're in the friend zone. Let's get into it. Do you have a map? Because I just get, keep getting lost in your eyes. That was, that was smooth. Okay, thank you, but yeah, you don't wanna talk to me? Sorry, I'm okay, in a rush. Don't wear such a nice shirt next time, then. Take care. Yeah, I can imagine if the tables were turned here, that wouldn't really go so well. Ember? Uh, I've got a girlfriend, I'm sorry. Well, you look like you can't ride a bike. It's not cheating. Going out seeking attention from other men. But going out. So in a sense it is. Okay. It's seeking validation. See, girls don't go out to get guys, they go out to put themselves in a position to be hit on. You know what I'm saying? Because it's not their role. <laughs> so it's basically an indirect way to get attention, but still is going after attention nonetheless. Oh, what's the reasons why you why you me? You mean? Yeah, money. But you cheap though. That get money, but cheap still. Like, bro. What's wrong with a cheap? Everything. I spend money on the right things. Everything is wrong with it. All right, there's nothing wrong with being a cheap. You feel me? If you guys have money and don't want to spend it on things that's not gonna benefit um, you in the long run, that's okay. But nah. If y'all really, then you do things like that. If it's somebody that you're not with. Do not use that as the first result. You gonna get me something? When I'm gonna get you? I'll get you something if you get me something. Yeah. Come yeah. on, like, I'm standing on pity. No, I'm just saying, like, like, if I'm gonna get you something, what I'm getting? I mean, a conversation <laughs> at least. <laughs> You know that Kai Sana can get her a whole lot of stuff, but he's still not a sip. So she's gonna have to work for it at least. You know, minding my cute little business. So this man is probably like four people ahead of me. And you know, when I come in, everybody turns around to see who's coming in the store as they should, you know, be aware of your surroundings. And you know, I noticed that he is looking a little longer than everybody. So I'm like, okay, he finds me a track, no biggie, right? So he's putting his order in and everything like that. I'm in the line waiting kind of on my phone but I can see him after he orders he kind of like steps out the way a little bit so that the next person can you know pay for their food he's kind of like looking back into the line I'm like okay he's kind of looking my way I don't know what he gonna do this is kind of weird to come up there so he can pay for my food <laughs> so I'm getting double rice I got chicken I don't never get chicken I done got a little extra uh guac I'm getting things like oh he finna pay for this so I ain't gonna have to worry about it honey I get to the point where it's time for me to pay she says like 17 something I'm like, okay. Now before I pull out my little wallet or whatever, I look back one more time, baby, it was nowhere to be found. I go outside, he, hey, excuse me, ma'am. I think you look so beautiful. Can I have your number? Y'all, please get out my face. I uh jingle that Chipotle bag, got in my car, and skirt right off on him as he stood there. Cause you think you're gonna get my number after you just watched me pay for my food and you was right there? Uh-uh. Mm -mm. Yeah, I don't really know why he really wanted her number after that, but that actually turned out to be a power move. Mission Alpha Man should cough up for a wedding ring. From oh, this is gonna be good. My understanding, a guy should be spending three months' salary on a ring. So if that isn't six figures, you probably shouldn't be getting married. Like, if he's not spending that, does he really love you, or does he just want a hot trophy wife? Let me do my research. Okay, Kelsey, we checked your Instagram. You're busting it open on the gram. But now I see a link tree. Let's tap that. Fans, let's do the math. Let's calculate that. How much is that a day? Seven dollars and fifty cents divided by thirty-one. This <laughs> making twenty cents a day. She's not even making a quarter a day off each person. But she wants a $30,000 ring. Listen, fellas, if she's complaining about the price of a ring, she's selling. Yeah, you do, in fact, marry the person and not the ring. So at that point, it doesn't really seem like you're missing out by not marrying her. Unless she shows you some other quality characteristics. <laughs> Issue. Too short? We about the same height. What? I'm six foot. <laughs> oh, what? How tall are you? Five feet, but in these heels, I feel like I'm giving a little bit taller. No. <laughs> I'm six foot. You know that, right? 
Whether or not he was actually six foot, he was a decent amount taller than her. But these height standards are just getting so ridiculous nowadays. Be you. Be real. Be authentic. Be you. Be real. Uh, says the girl that has a BBL and a heap of work done. And there's nothing wrong with getting work done. But if you're going to quote, be real, be authentic. How about you be honest to your followers, your millions of followers, that you've had a BBL done, that you've had a heap of work done. And if you're going to quote, be real, what do you mean real? Your body ain't real. And it just drives me crazy when people are trying to be motivating with these quotes and it's not in line with what they actually are. Yeah, it reminds me of the clearly unnatural bodybuilders trying to sell you on buying their protein drinks so you could get big like them. Like, no. Masters in public administration, and I have a law degree. How tall are you? Five nine. Dress size? 16. You didn't choose to be single? I'm sorry? Uh, I'm gonna rate their looks on a scale of one to 10. 10. Five, ten, nine, two, six, six, uh, six. Oh yeah, uh, I give myself a five. Andrew? Uh, I would say I'm a four. Question for the 10 and the nine. Do you think you'll be better looking in 10 years as yes. compared to now? Okay, so you're 25. Yeah. You'll be better looking at 35 as compared to now at 25? For sure. Let's uh, double it. 20 years, better looking at 45 as compared to now at 25. No, I think like late 30s are the real prime. Yes. I'm sorry. I'm 35 right now and I do not look better than I did at 25. And I'm 36 and I don't look better than I did at 26. Mm. Well, I don't drink alcohol and and I take care of myself, so I have high hopes. Good genes. I mean, she could do whatever it is she wants to do to stay healthy, which is great. Can't complain about that, but father time is undefeated. What? My girlfriend just accused me of having zero empathy. I don't even understand how she can feel that way. Whatever, it was supposed to be a joke. You don't laugh at anything anymore. Hey, you've been married as long as I have. You won't laugh at anything either. Just because we wear fake hair doesn't mean we're not natural. Like we have natu naturally beautiful skin, naturally beautiful personality. So why are you coming at us? You have a naturally beautiful personality, really? Absolutely. Where's your husband at? <laughs> I don't have a husband. I don't need a man. <laughs> Y'all need us more than anything. So what's funny? Listen, folks, we got somebody up here with a naturally beautiful personality. Absolutely. With a naturally beautiful she talking about all this natural beauty. She ain't got no husband. Because I don't want one. So so self care is the best care. I bet you don't. I bet you I'm, don't. I'm 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 turning twenty six next well, tomorrow. I'm Good turning 26 Good tomorrow. No, we don't and care. I don't need a man for nothing. Care. I'm young. I'm beautiful. Good. And Guess what? We yeah, don't I don't care. have to settle for nobody or nothing. Guess what? We don't care. And I don't care neither. You obviously do care. Well, right? obviously you do care because you up here. This is my show. You on my life. So what? People are I mean, here You're see funny. Business. You're hilarious. And now I'm People here to are see here. me. Watch this. Now I'm going to shut you up. People are here to see me. They're not here to see you. Nobody's showing up to see you. No husband, no man. Look, I knew they was going. That's all they got. That's all they can do. The same old jokers. That's all they can do. The proof is in the pudding. He was the one with the show while she was just on it. And it would help her to get some advice from an actual wife. Now, yes, I think this is kind of setting a... It's changing up the dynamics a little bit that he wouldn't even pay for a little bit of her birthday party. So she's getting into ballet. There's recitals coming up. There are other things coming up. And I'm just <clears throat> nervous that she's going to see that imbalance in our relationship and it's going to cause something. But you're creating the imbalance. $1,500 $1, yeah. for an eight-year-old birthday party? That's not, that doesn't. That doesn't sound, it sounds bad when you say it out of the context, but that's normal. No, no, within the that context, is, that is ridiculous. That is normal. No, it's Last not normal. Susie no. had a birthday party that cost $2,000. So, so I you're think trying that, to keep up with Susie? Well, I didn't do 2000 I could have done 2000 and I think I kept it out of a reasonable cost. She wait got a minute, to meet wait Tara. a Pauls. Can you speak some reason to uh, me? I, I would love to try, Your Honor. Uh, I am more than happy to help our daughter celebrate and live her life, but there there comes a point where it's just you know it's frivolous. It's I awkward, agree. You know I I would have been fine going halfway down the middle of just like 
paying to have some kids to the skating rink, but we don't, we did not need Tara Lipinski there. I thought that you were joking when you said that, which yeah. is why I didn't respond. Yeah, she's definitely putting herself over him and let alone the entire marriage. Because just one of those wild expenses could actually be a down payment on a nice house if they don't have one already, or at least some money towards it. And you're not gonna pay for my food. For the last time, I'm only paying for myself. I thought we agreed that you would pay. Lady, who even are you? All right, I hope you guys enjoy these ones and don't forget to like, subscribe and check out the video right above me.